We arrived at Brigadier Gwanga's home at around 11.30 a.m. Our mission to speak to the man who has been in the news in the past week, a subject in the media for alleged illegal possession of land and home that he has lived in for the last 25 years in Makindia Division, a Kampala suburb. There were no owners. We found something hollow, like you go in a bush and finding a hut. Okay, this was a block. But I remember, what I remembered about it, you see the other house down there? That used to be Brigadier Bogeri's residence. And 1972, when I was 20 years, I used to guard that house, and this house was here. As we converse with the one star general over matters of acquisition of this home, which is reported to be home of the former Kenyan president Mwai Kibaki, his body language indicates that Kasiye Gwanga is not bothered, and he keeps on playing with his German shepherd dog called Boy. But he reveals that the matter has already attracted the attention of President Museveni, who called him and scheduled a meeting to discuss it. But the defiant former NRM fighter says even the president should go slow and get all the facts. I would have asked him, you are telling me to get out of the house. As who? Is this your house? You are the president of the country. You interfering with my residence? Do you rent my house? Do you pay rent for me? So all of those are just, in fact, you guys. You are dangerous, but you don't know who you are dealing with. You are dealing with Kasiye Gwanga. I'm not an idiot. The first attempt to evict him was last week by a city lawyer, Juan Odari, who was in company of a UPDF Lieutenant Kano Mugabe and the Metropolitan Police Commander for Kampala, Andrew Felix Kawesi. Kasiye Gwanga, however, does not treat it as an attempted eviction. The legs. I make you lame to realize, for you to realize your mistake. Why do you come to me? You can't even give me a call. Man, I'm a brigadier general. You don't get a star. You see that vehicle? Star, how many vehicles do you star? He also says for anything to be done, including arresting him, it should only be by a person at his rank and not a junior officer, even if plans to evict him are still on course. I'm a military man. If you come to arrest me, you come with the brigadier general, with the military police. The CPA says you are being arrested because of this and this. I'll just say yes, sir. Neto ina kuna lieutenant kano, owa joan, nchi agena kuata kasiye guanga, onkwa atirachi. What's the matter with you guys? You think you are dealing with idiots? You are dealing with very, very dangerous people. While he declined to show us the lease documents, he claims he obtained in 2005 from the Buganda Land Board. He accepts that in 1986, when they took over power, the structure which he now says is his home had no people living in it, and he never knew the previous occupants or the owners. The lease title of this home, according to Gwanga, expired in 2005 and in the same year he applied for a lease of 49 years from the Buganda Land Board. Timothy Basi, WSTV, Kampala.